because of that east wind, but that east wind is doing us a big favor, especially when it starts to turn east-southeast. It's going to warm us up. Okay. And there's a reason behind it all. That area of high pressure that was located in the Gulf of Mexico yesterday, now off the eastern seaboard. It moved right across the state, and as it did so, our wind shifted as a result. So now we have more of an east-southeast wind. I want you to go ahead and take a look at your future winds over the next 24 hours. Watch as we go through this morning into this afternoon. Watch the wind. Watch that arrow. Now do east. 5, 15 miles per hour times. Getting a little stronger as we get into your Monday afternoon. 15, 20 miles per hour. Now out of the southeast. That's cranking in a little more moisture. Yes, so we'll call it partly cloudy. Mostly cloudy in some areas tomorrow afternoon. Regardless, we still have some sunshine and that southerly wind to warm us up over the next few days. So I want you to take a look here. 78 expected for your Monday. Tuesday and Wednesday and Thursday. We're back into the 80s and we are cranking it up Wednesday into Thursday in the upper 80s. 86 on Wednesday, 88 on Thursday. That's 10 degrees above where we should be this time of year. So it definitely starts to feel a little more like summer out ahead of our next cool front. So 78 again for tomorrow. Windy with a southeast wind at 15 to 20 miles per hour. Thank goodness we have the wind. And of course it does draw in a few more clouds because of that east wind. That east wind churning up our seas a bit, two to four feet. That moderate rip current risk still in place, so take it easy. Don't go out in the water if you don't have to. And seas again at two to four feet thanks to that southeast wind at 15 knots. No hazards in place, so you can go out on the boat if you'd like to. Here's South Florida certified. Most accurate forecast over the next seven days. That high in control really for some time all the way through Thursday. And again, because of that wind shift, our temperatures go right back up into the mid to upper 80s. It's Friday now. The front starts to move through. It slows down a little bit here, so our rain chances go up to a 30 percent shot here on Friday. Really not all that much to worry about, but what the big thing is with this front is the temperature drop. We go near 10 degrees, if not more, on Friday. So 88 on Thursday, down to 76 on Friday and staying into the 70s for your upcoming weekend with a little more sunshine. Gianna.